Hi everyone, this is JD, your gadget review friend. Today I'll show you the easiest and the fastest way to install Google services and other apps to your Huawei or Honor phone. Hey, don't forget to subscribe, my friend. Let's go. Let's start from the beginning when you set up your phone for the first time. This will be step by step considering you're not a techie person. From the beginning, choose the right language and the right keyboard for your Huawei or Honor phone. I'm using English for everyone who's watching this video and just finished setting up your phone, no added instructions needed. The second most important thing to do is to remove all the bloatware and clean up your phone. Hold down the app and click uninstall. One thing I hate about the Chinese ROMs are the bloatwares. Good thing you can simply remove them. It will be a pain in the beginning, but once you remove them, you're all set. Okay, now we're ready to install Google services and apps. The next thing to do is to install a good browser. The Huawei and Honor browser is good, but it's full of Chinese character and the search will direct you to the Chinese server. Start with Firefox, install the first thing that comes out of search. It is proven secure. Okay, now that you successfully installed the good browser, replace the native browser app. Honestly, you can install Mozilla Firefox or Opera Mini. I just prefer Mozilla Firefox. Now we're all set. Your phone looks like a global version ROM. This will be a three-part step. First, install Aptoid or Aurora Store for common apps. So, Chinese ROMs are still Android OS and on Google dependent apps that doesn't require Google services can easily be installed using Aptoid or Aurora Store. It works similar to Google Play Store, you search for the app and then install. The second step is to install GSpace. This works similar to Dual Space, it's like a virtual OS. Inside this virtual OS, it has a pre-installed information of Huawei phones with working Google services. GSpace tricks my phone that it is Huawei Mate 20. So, this is your final setup now. Let's begin installing Google Apps with services to your phone. First, open your GSpace and you will see Google Apps inside. If you click one of them, it will open Play Store. Again, this virtual environment is simulating May 20, so you can just log in with your Google account and proceed installing the apps. Just a side note, if you want to go back to Play Store, simply click any of the installed app and click Upgrade. That will bring you back to Play Store to install more Google Apps. Now to make this a seamless approach, from GSpace, hold down the app again and click Create Shortcut. This will create a shortcut of the Google app to your home screen. So now you can access YouTube, Gmail, Maps, and other Google Apps directly to your home screen like a regular Google app on Huawei or Honor phone. Once you finish installing all Google Apps you need and create shortcut on your home screen, I suggest make a folder for Google on your home screen. Feels like a regular global ROM. Now if an app is not Google service dependent, open Aurora Store or Aptoid and install directly there. One, it is faster to manage these apps there and updating will be easier too. Let's try to install Twitter, Facebook, and WhatsApp. And third, some Google apps like Duo or Google Drive won't work on GSpace. You might encounter these issues with some apps. You can always use the browser version and access it in Firefox. It will work. Just don't forget to add a home screen shortcut of these web links so you can directly access them from the home screen. So, this is the easiest way to install Google services and other apps to your Huawei and Honor phone. You don't need to be tech savvy, just follow the simple tricks. So that's the easiest way without rooting or hacking your phone. Let me know in the comment section if this is helpful and share your other methods too. And as always, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one.